I'm Angela. I'm Leah. And, and we, we out, out here. here. Hey y'all, so this video will share some clips from UCF's homecoming step show. We went to a few homecoming activities this year and had a really good time. We thought we would do some voiceovers and use this as a little get to know us. First, we had to record this video on Angela's iPhone because the arena doesn't allow cameras inside. This is the same arena that housed the T-Pain concert that we showed y'all a couple of weeks ago. So I'm not sure if we have ever said it on this channel, but Angela is an AKA and I am a Delta. Neither of us had been to a step show in a really long time, so we were really excited when we saw this advertised. The funny thing is that the theme was Greek Nick, and although the, they encouraged people to dress to the theme, I believe that we were probably the only ones to actually dress in a 90s theme. It wasn't too embarrassing since we didn't go above and beyond for the theme. We really just put on big gold earrings and I put on fake nails, but we absolutely could have saved money by not buying all those accessories. But it is what it is. So uh, we like the themes of the different performances. Many of the steppers picked like a 90s to early 2000s movie to create a segment about. They had movies like Major Pain, Bring It On, Barbershop, Rush Hour, Space Jam, set it off you've you've been served um and other film and other films they had really cute skits strolls and steps to to their themed storylines um so there also was like two separate segments so the first half of the step show was what i just told you about the second half of the step show was up to the creativity of the performers they picked a theme and they stepped to that so you'll see some people do like um a y2k theme some people did like a mario brothers theme which was pretty cool as well Like Leah said, um, it had been a long time since I had been to a step show, uh, so I was really excited to get to this step show. I enjoyed it so much. Uh, I met a lot of sorors there. Uh, they were super nice and super fun. A lot of them were alumni of the university or um, current sorors, uh, so we just had a good time chatting and all of that. Um, actually, I think the most recent step show that I went to was... Um, for AKA Regional Conference. Um, and actually in that step show, it was my first and last time stepping. Um, I'm not much of a stepper, but we actually won second place. Um, our grad chapter won second place. Uh, so I guess we did pretty good. <laughs> so growing up, I actually was on a competitive dance team. Um, I won't tell a lie and say that I was the best dancer on the team. Um, I actually did it for probably about five years, maybe from like hmm, fourth grade to eighth grade, somewhere around there. Um, but I really enjoyed it. My favorite part was actually traveling with the group because we did a lot of that. Um, and just, you know, being in that type of team. Um, so in addition to dancing, I actually um, played other sports as well. I tried volleyball. Uh, I did a little basketball for maybe two years, and actually, a little known fact, I wanted to be in the WNBA growing up. That was one of my goals. I loved the sport of basketball. Uh, I quickly found out that I was no good at basketball or sports in general, so I actually just stuck with band, which I had a good time with. I did that to high school. Like Angela, I was no good at sports, still am not good at sports, but as a kid, I did try most of them and found out quickly 
that I was not good at it. Anything that involves any types of type of coordination, I can just go ahead and assume that I won't be good at it. Um, but interestingly, I do like badminton. And when I was in grad school, I played roller derby for fun. Now, although I played does not mean that I was good at it because I actually sucked. Horrible. We didn't get a whole lot of pictures this night, so you'll you'll see me stick in a few random pictures that we were able to snap throughout the evening. So enjoy some pictures of <laughs> me and Angela and other people as well. Before we continue, y'all, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Please, please, please. Also, comment and let us know, are y'all coordinated? So, fun fact, I am extremely uncoordinated. Never could step, can hardly dance, and can hardly stroll to the most basic of strolls. Um, my go-to dance is a little two-step, specifically the Baltimore two-step, and that's all I got. Y'all let us know what y'all got in the comments. Also, y'all, if there's anything that y'all want to see or do from us um, anywhere in like the Orlando, Florida area, let us know in the comments. So we do live in Orlando, so there's so much stuff that we haven't done yet uh, that we do want to do. Uh, and of course, we'll make a video for you all to show you. So uh, anything you plan on doing, you want to review or whatever, let us know in the comments. I thought it was really cool that the school had homecoming fireworks. I have never seen a school throw a fireworks show for homecoming, so impressed was an understatement. The fireworks were absolutely beautiful throughout the evening. I just thought the show was amazing. I was also really impressed with the fireworks. Um, I have never seen uh, schools do fireworks at homecoming, um, but actually one of the ladies that I met at the fireworks said that they do fireworks for everything down here in Orlando. Uh, so maybe that explains uh the festivities here um but before the fireworks they looked like they had some type of festival where they had food and drinks so it looked really nice um lee and i have did not go to the homecoming football game um but we do have tickets for an upcoming game that we're really excited about uh so we'll let you guys know how that goes um but yeah we're really looking forward to it so that football game will probably be the next video. And then we have some more upcoming videos as well as an Arizona trip that we're excited about.
right, y'all. It's been sweet. Check us out next week. When we out here in, in these the streets. streets. Peace. It's five in the morning. I wake up to five for my yard. Yeah, my